Today we have a John Deere 2054 uh, with a power clamp and this power clamp doesn't open. It rotates but yeah it doesn't want to open. Okay I'm going to show you my troubleshooting and diagnosis. Okay let's start the machine and uh, confirm the issue first as usual. Okay my machine is running. Let's Say to lock up. Okay. Press RPM. Close that clamp. It's turning clockwise, counterclockwise, and now we're trying to open. I don't hear any pump respond, and when I pushed this upper button it's for closing I can hear the pump means our solenoid energized and it's working now right but this one doesn't work pretty much straightforward let's show you what I did let's put it on the ground okay close this one up there we go all right it's pretty easy and uh, always start with the basic easiest things to check okay i have my test light connected to known good ground test light works i know that i test it okay let's turn the key to the on position and uh, check the good switch and i'm not going to check the fuses or relays because i know my rest of my functions they work let's get straight to the switch and every switch has two wires and one is a feed okay let's test working good switch as soon as i touch the power my test light is lighting it's on and uh, this one's cold so there's no power but when i push the button close the circuit right the switch is working and we know our closing function on the grapple works let's try this switch now okay and let's see if we are getting power to our switch yes power is at the switch over here all good and let's check on another side of the switch and push the button and nothing's happening means our switch is open and we have a problem with the switch let's replace this micro switch and see how it works i have some extra micro switches from the local radio electronics store this is a part number i will put all information down in the description check it out i'm going to put a new switch okay i have my new micro switch connected let's see how it works okay let's start the machine again Rub it up a bit. Okay. Lift it up. Okay. Clamp is closed now. Let's open it. Okay, here we pop now. And let's open it. There's no switch. Yep, it's working. Well, I'm going to solder this connection and uh, yeah we'll call it fixed nice and easy repair not that difficult and uh, yeah, always look for parts you can easy to get and check and also look for moving components like switches can you imagine how many times you have to push the switch on and off and that's where the where tear is happening most likely and uh, yeah worn out burn contacts at the switch yeah now we're good yeah okay, i hope this video is helpful if it's helpful thumbs up if you have any questions leave them down in the comment section below under the video thank you so much as usual for your time watching this video and uh, take care bye bye